What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Model WordPress Teams and in today's video we're gonna learn how to use the button widgets from Borderless WordPress plugin in order to apply a button into our WordPress header navigation menu. So we can be in top header, into the main header, depending on the theme that you are using and where does this theme allow you to apply widgets. But you can apply these buttons in sidebars, in footers, in any location that you can apply a widget. First of all, make sure that you have installed and activated the Borderless WordPress plugin. I'm gonna leave a link in the description below and a card over here for a video tutorial where I do explain how to install and activate the Borderless free WordPress plugin. And after this, go to WordPress dashboard appearance widgets and find a place to apply your button. I'm gonna be adding the button into the right and left top header navigation. Click into the plus button, into the section after locating where you want to apply this button. It can be on the sidebar, on the footer, but in my case, I'm going to be adding the top header right section. After this, type borderless button and select the widget. You can choose the color, the primary and secondary and other colors can be set onto the plugin setup panel into WordPress dashboard, left sidebar. And after this, the type, the shape, you can apply the title, the link, make it full widget and even apply a new follow tag in the case that you want. And here's the result. Once we are working with two columns, top header style, the button gonna appear one and one like this, but you can edit it into the theme settings in the case that you are using Word, a visual model WordPress theme. Let me apply a single button and apply a spacer so I can share with you some nice tricky in the case that you want to apply more space to your button. I recommend that you remove the first button, but here's the result. We can apply some borders around the button without CSS needs, but we can apply it also using CSS in the case that you know how to code a little bit. Let me remove this Aster Spacer. This is just another of the borderless plugin elements that I'm gonna share how to use in the next video. But it's one example of the buttons usage and button alignment in the case that you need. Let me remove these buttons from the left side and apply two ones into the right side so you can see the full widget option. Same process, click onto the plus button, set up the button link, title, color, shape. I'm gonna set this new one is full widget and here's how the button will look like into our menu. This is nice in the case that you want to show a big notes into our website, for example, linking to some landing page of a promotion. And here's what we have. You can make these buttons a little wider and a little taller in the case that you want, or you can even make it small. It depends on the layout that you are looking for. Let's move the first widget to the left, and here's the result we have.
And that is, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question. And don't forget to check out the visualmodo.com portfolio of amazing WordPress themes and the Borderless free WordPress plugin for this and many more options for WordPress customization and tools. And I see you later. All the best!